Let's also now take you to a unique protest in Delhi. A giant pink buff is going from the Munirka bus stop in Delhi where the gang rape victim was picked up on December 16 to Saket Court where the trial is now happening. For more, uh, let's go across to Sonal Mehrotra. Sonal, uh, the big pink bus as it were is making its way from Munirka to Saket. Uh, what's really happening on the bus right now? Well, Ketke, I can tell you I'm on board with Prime Minister Manmohan Singh. I, I wish I could say that in all seriousness. But we are on board on the pink bus, which I which you rightly said is moving from the Munirka bus stop, the very dreaded Munirka bus stop wherein the gang rape victim, the dreaded night of 16th December, boarded the bus from. And it's walking and it's uh, going uh, ceremoniously towards Saket Court, where today itself, as we speak, the, uh, the accused are going to be tried. Uh, this, uh, this entire route and this entire campaign has been done by an NGO. We'll go across to them and try and understand what exactly is the motive. Uh, Tamanna, tell me, you guys are going in this big way with the big man Mohan Singh behind you. Tell me, what's the purpose? The purpose is for the government, uh, we want the government to commit to mass education campaign. The mass education campaign. Uh, we've seen, you know, through the day, we've seen lots of uh, uh, recommendations come in. Justice Varma Committee's report also uh, gave forth lots of questions. I want to understand what more are you guys looking at? Uh, it comes to mass education. Uh, are you looking at it in a way that perhaps the way polio was built up, the way, uh, you know, Bollywood, everybody was involved? Is that one of the motives? Yes. You know, to end the rape crisis in India, we have to go deeper. We have to really change the attitudes of the people and we think the only way we can do this is a mass education campaign launched by the government backed by substantial money and a long-term commitment and um, only like this will touch the hearts of the Indians and this is the only way we can actually change the attitudes towards women and end, end this crisis. Attitudes towards women, perhaps that is the key issue. That's what even uh, the Chief Justice of India, even the Varma Committee report is talking about. It's not just about stricter laws, but perhaps sensitization towards women at the grassroots. That's what we're looking at? Yes, because we grew up watching our men wife beating their wives. That's what we want to stop. That's what we don't want to grow up and become. And what's this big Manmohan Singh doing behind you? Tell me more about him. We could not meet Manmohan Singh and he's our leader. Probably his silence means, what should I do? That's when we, wa uh, we want to give him the suggestion. And why the pink bus? Do you want more and more of these pink buses out on the streets for security of women? Is that also the, one of the ideas? You know, it's a symbol. You know, we are showing the government that this is a thing that they can do. It's very concrete. It's a low effort public awareness campaign. That's what we are, though, we, we are showing the example to the government. Showing an example, putting forward a word in front of the government saying that, you know, perhaps they could not meet Prime Minister Manmohan Singh, but they have him, at least his caricature here, talking about it. What they're also talking about is the fact that, you know, sensitization needs to be done at the grassroots. People, people like you and I, apart from just laws and just talking about uh, stricter laws, have to get people sensitized, moral policing, self-policing, one of those issues. Perhaps that's the message coming out from this pink bus uh, that we're coming to you from. Back to you, Ketki. All right, Sonal, a unique protest actually to drive the point home. That certainly is very interesting. Thanks so much for joining us.